I'd ask that uh, the congregation would make standing as we pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the privilege of being in the body of Christ and for experiencing your love and the union with your Holy Spirit. We've come together to watch the miracle of your love and the power of your Spirit in taking two separate and distinct lives and joining them together in one, one. We give you the praise, the honor, and the glory for the power of your Spirit in our lives to bring us into this unity with you and with one another. For the sanctity and the holiness of the covenant bonds of marriage with which we come together and wish the families to grow. And we thank you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. You can have a seat.
and be there for them. Okay? Now to the congregation, you're also here for an important purpose. You're here because you love these guys. And I want you to understand that they pray and they believe with all their hearts God's will for them to be here. And you're being here today is to say yes and amen to that. And from this day forward, I want to encourage you to always, always to be a support to them in everything that you do. Okay. You ready for this? All right. After hearing the charges of Scripture, do you, Nathan, take Vanessa to be your lawfully wedded wife? Do you promise to support her and love her? Do you solemnly pledge before God and these witnesses that you'll be faithful to her for the remainder of your life? If so, be sad to do. Very good. And you, Vanessa, after hearing the charges of Scripture, do you take Nathan to be your lawfully wedded husband? Do you solemnly pledge to stand before him and love him? Do you solemnly pledge before God and these witnesses that you'll be faithful to him for the remainder of your life? All right. Okay, Nathan, I want you to say these words to your bride. I love you, Vanessa. And today, in the presence of your family and friends, I pledge myself to you. I promise before God to love you, to honor you, and to cherish you. As God enables me, I will provide for all of your needs and love. I love you. Be my home. And what token do you give as a heaven's show favorite for your house? Very good. Okay. Thank you. Nathan has chosen a ring. This ring is the token of the marriage covenant. It's made out of precious and enduring metal, symbolizing the precious and enduring relationship established in this covenant. This ring is a never-ending circle, symbolic of God's never-ending love for you. It's a love that never fails. And it will be God's type of love flowing one towards the other that will make your marriage come full circle in commitment and love. As these rings are always on your finger, let them be reminders of the profession of faith and love that you made to each other today. So, I want you to take this and place it on your finger and say, with this ring, with this ring, I'll be wed. I'll be wed. Very good. And Vanessa, what token do you give that you faithfully fulfill your vows? Very good. Thank you. I want you to place this ring on this finger and repeat this with me. With this ring, I do it. Lord bless you and keep you. Lord make your face and shine upon you and be gracious to you. Lord, lift up his confidence upon you and give you peace. And now, as a reverend of Jesus Christ before Almighty God, in the name of the Father, His Son Jesus, and by the power of the Holy Spirit, I pronounce you man and wife. And you can get your pride. We have chosen as your first act together as husband and wife, honor the Lord, communion table. I know. You guys are great. Jesus said, This bread is my body given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Today, uh, you give yourself to the Lord as husband and wife to each other. So go ahead. He also said, this cup is my blood of the covenant, which is poured out for the forgiveness of sins. And as you take the cup this morning, I want you to always remember, always forgive each other.
Lord, I do thank you for Nathan and Jonas. God bless him right now. For our two grace upon them. I thank you, Lord, for providing for every need that they have. I thank you for showing them your good pleasure, not only for today, but for the rest of their lives. In Jesus' name. Amen. Why don't you turn face, everybody? Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Nathan. I choose you. 